What's up guys, my name is Samuel Leeds and in this video I'm going to be giving you the truth about passive income. Now this is kind of like a flip side with some of the negatives and preconceptions around passive income that you may have heard from other people or even heard things from me and thought, passive income, is it really that easy? So as someone who's been in business now for 12 years, who's accumulated a lot of properties, who's worked in business, who's written books and been preaching passive income for many years, I want to give you the actual reality and my hands-on experience of passive income. If you like my videos, please do subscribe, turn the notification bell on, and you need to destroy the like button, okay? So if the little blue thumbs up, or if it's not blue, that's bad. You need the button to be blue throughout this video. I'd really appreciate that. Thank you so much. So first thing I want to say about passive income is this. Passive income is hard. If you want to create a lot of passive income, and I hear people talking about creating millions of pounds worth of passive income, in my opinion, that is not impossible, but is very, very difficult to achieve. If you want to achieve £2,000 a month, that's fine. £2,000 a month in passive income, very attainable. You want to achieve £500,000 a year or millions of pounds a year in passive income, that's going to take a particular kind of person, it's going to take a very long time, it's going to be a lot of hard graft and work. So that's the first thing I'll say about passive income. Next thing I'll say about passive income is this, passive income doesn't necessarily mean you have to do absolutely nothing for it. The definition of passive income is income that's coming with little to no maintenance by yourself. That doesn't mean absolutely nothing. So yes, it's gonna give you a totally different type of lifestyle, but in my experience, most of the passive income streams that I've got coming in, not all of them, some of them are completely passive where I do nothing, but normally speaking, you're gonna to have to tweak a few things here and there, stay on top of it every week or two, check what's going on, check in with people. That is just normal, okay? So that's just setting the expectations right. Third thing I wanna say about passive income is this. Don't just pursue passive income alone. Passive income is great, massive income is also great. If you're trying to combine passive income and massive income and that's all you're focusing on, my advice would be active income, there's nothing wrong with working for money. There's nothing wrong with trading your time for money as long as when you do it, you're using the profits that you're making to then put into investments, to then put into something that's gonna give you passive income. It's like rowing a boat. You want two oars? You want to be working for money? You want to be trading your time for money and making massive income? For sure. But then, take the money and then you want to row the other oar as well, which is putting it into passive income streams. So it's massive, it's passive, it's massive, it's passive. You're being an entrepreneur over here, where you're doing things like deal packaging. Deal packaging is trading your time for money. You're finding deals, you're selling them to investors. Deal packaging, getting money and then you're putting it into investments and building a passive income over here. Sell a deal, invest in a deal. Sell a few deals, invest in a deal. And that's how you need to get wealthy, in my experience. So that's my overall thoughts on passive income. I hope you found this useful. Passive income is real, it does exist. One more thing I'll say as a bonus piece of content. You might think right now, if you're working in a job for two, three, four, five thousand pounds a month and you're working really hard and you're thinking, oh my gosh, I wish I just had a few thousand pounds in passive income and then I could just lie on a beach forever, I promise you this, you become financially free, you will not want to stop working. You will get bored lying on a beach forever. When I became financially free, I climbed Kilimanjaro, I learned to play different instruments, I wrote an album, I went on lots of holidays, I traveled, but believe me, you're gonna get bored. So enjoy what you do. That's the most important advice I can say. Find something that you love doing, because if you love doing it, it won't feel like work. If you wanna see more about passive income, you wanna learn more about property, you wanna learn more about finance, subscribe to the channel. Thank you for having the blue thumb up. I know you liked the video. I trust that you did that, and I'll see you next time.